Hello Pisces and cross watchers. Thank you guys so much for joining in. Welcome to Natural Healing Tarot. Today we are going to take a look at your advice reading for the month of January. If you find the messages helpful or that it resonates with your situation, please feel free to like the video or comment below. Also, if you would like future messages, you are more than welcome to subscribe to the channel. Everyone is always welcome and I upload messages daily. So, Pisces. Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. What can we see for you? Also, guys, please keep in mind the messages here on YouTube are general. They're not going to resonate every time with every person. You are more than welcome to check other signs within your birth chart. It's really about the title. If there's something in the title that resonates, there's most likely something in the message for you. I do a drawing here every month for a free personal reading. If it's something that you're interested in entering in to see if you win, you are more than welcome. All you have to do is comment your astrological sign below. And last but certainly not least, I pull a power thought card at the end of every message. So if you find the messages resonating, I do think it's helpful to stay until the end. It's just a little positive boost and the energy really flows all the way through all of the decks. Okay, so Pisces, love, risk, and oath. Let's get the sense here that there's something that you're going to have to take a risk on in order to get the love that you want, the love that you desire. I really get the sense here, Pisces, that the old way of doing things isn't isn't working okay there's a need here to try a new approach new approach to this love so let's see the tarot has to say pisces for you for january most important message for pisces spirit what does pisces need to see for the month of january about this risk about this new approach. New approach to love. Do we need to see? Is discord within family? some more info out here for you. I feel like this could be a family, your family, your children, your children's father or husband or wife. This could also be family like relative family, okay, that this discord is happening within. I feel like Pisces that this discord has caused you to be distant with your family. There's a need to release this. I also feel like there's a need to let go of that sense of abandonment. Maybe um, looking into healing childhood traumas or forgiving parents, something along those lines. Okay. Now. Let me announce the cards. We have the Ten of Pentacles in reverse, the Empress in reverse, Knight of Pentacles, Five of Pentacles, and the King of Swords. What this is saying here, Pisces, is this discord within your family, it's kind of like you have a resentment towards your parents. Maybe they weren't able to be there. They were always working. Uh, maybe they... they Whatever the case may be, they weren't always present in your life because there is a feeling of being left, okay? Understand here, Pisces, that everybody does the best that they can with the life that they are given and the options that they have to choose from. And sometimes those options are either go to work or not have any food on the table. That is a very real scenario in a lot of homes nowadays, especially, okay? But I do get the sense that this 
this discord within your situation is causing more sadness, more hardship. Now I understand you want to stand your ground and that is very well. You should want to stand your ground, okay? You are right for feeling that way. But I feel like the King of Swords is more of a cold energy, more of a matter of fact, very practical, very emotionally distant energy, okay? I feel like there's a need to change your perspective here for sure, okay? I feel like you're going to need to forgive your parents. I'm just going to say it. There's, there's no beating around the bush. The energy that's coming out here, Pisces, is a need to forgive your parents. For whatever reason, um, you have some ill feelings towards family members. It's causing discord. And until this is healed, I feel like you're going to be in this limbo. Okay? Now, just because you apologize or are given an apology for a certain situation or express how you feel, try to give forgiveness, whatever the case may be, you're still going to have this situation still happen to you, okay? So you're still going to have these memories. It's just not going to trigger you when you let this go. But the lesson is still there. Okay, you're not going to go through this again. I feel like you've learned the lesson that you needed to learn through this. But now holding on to this lesson is causing more harm than good. And at one time, it very well could have been serving. But now it's causing this discord. The different approach is trying to be more open. Express how you feel to your parents. Express how that made you feel in that moment, you know, even if there, you do understand that they had to work or they couldn't be there at that moment for whatever reason, it still hurt you. And that is a very valid feeling and it is okay to express that. And you might find that that wasn't their intentions at all, that their intentions were completely different. Now it's up to you. Everybody has free will. Understand that. The advice that's coming through the cards here, though, Pisces, is trying to resolve this discord within your family. Okay. I am going to take a deeper look into this. I want to take a look at the person's position, whether it's your parents, your cousin, husband, wife. I'm going to take a look at their position, what they're coming in as, what they're coming across as i also want to take a look at where this is headed maybe some advice we'll get the psychic tarot the guidance cards out if that's something you're interested in the link will be below in the description box the power thought card that's coming out for you pisces is i release all fears and doubts i accept myself and create peace in my mind and heart I now choose to free myself from all destructive fears and doubts. I am loved and I am safe. I release all fears and doubts. So, Pisces, that is the message I have for you coming out. If you want to get in on the extended reading, the link will be below in the description box. Otherwise, Thank you guys so much for all the love and support. Thank you guys so much for liking, subscribing, sharing the content. And I look forward to seeing your beautiful souls again soon. Namaste.